Alrighty, welcome everybody. Gaming Mike here. No Man's Sky back on it with the survival mode. Ooh, no, we were just leaving this place. We were just leaving this place last time we left off, I believe. Thanks for joining me on the journey. Let's get reacquainted with where we were. I stocked up iron because I was going to go to space. I have a bunch of stuff for my spaceship. I need spadonium, so I need to find a new system. Before I do that, I need I need to probably hit the space station. That's probably a good idea. I think I should hit the space station and see if I can trade for some antimatter so that I can make some space journeys. Or I could go investigate this crash ship too. I don't know. And there's my base way off in the distance. Where is the space station? There it is. Bunch of freighters that way. Oh, you know what? Iron in my inventory. I don't care about the chromium. Uh, yeah, I can go over there. And the fascination dude. And some zinc. That'll have to do. I gotta get there. Let's go. Let's go, go, go. Phase Archer, welcome to the chat. Thanks for joining. Just headed for the space station. Hoping for no pirates. Nice to have you along. Let's hope it goes well. Not put on the scan yet. Anything could happen in a minute. Anything at all. Yikes. <clears throat> oh, here they come. I'm gonna have to fight them. Ooh. I've got a lot of iron. For shields. What do I think they'll add on future updates? I've heard about the buggy coming out. Well, there's that to look forward to. God, just like that. Polluted by crimes and torn by the bitterest blah blah blah. Oh, sigh. <laughs> I was going to sell all that stuff too. At least I still have these things. I guess. Ugh. That sucks. That sucks. But at least here I can shop for some antimatter, right? Does uh, life support not get drained in a space station? Huh. Well, I'm full after running and jetpacking. Interesting. I guess it doesn't use it up. I guess that makes sense. What with atmospheric controls and everything, right? Sure, why not? Sure, why not? Hello, you geck. Hello, all you geck. Ugh. Got no antimatter. Oof. Blinded by the light. Any carbon plants? I already took it. Already harvested, pal. 
What do you think they'll put in future updates, Phase Archer? What are you hoping for? What would you like to see? Here comes a trader. Exporter Sija. Sija. Any antimatter, friend? Nope. Nope. Here comes this guy. Better not be the same guy. Nope. It's not. That's good. Captain Funk? Are you kidding me? It's Captain Funk. <laughs> oh my goodness. Don't forget to say hey to Captain Funk if you see him. <laughs> Holy cow, that's too funny. Is that Captain Funk again? Yep, it's Captain Funk again. No thanks, Captain. Not today. if I just blast to the next system anyway. I need desert planets. That one's got three planets. There's me. But I can't hit green or red stars, can I? Uh, or tau required. I saw a red star there. Can I go to a red? Nope. Only yellows. Only yellows. Five planets, one moon. I can go there. That's a pretty good smattering. That's six bodies. The search. Nekumoxian. Yep, let's go there. Let's do it. Off we go, guys. Thanks for joining. Survival mode tonight. Gaming Mike here. Glad to have you. Be sure to hit that like button if you're enjoying the No Man's Sky Foundation update streams. I know I have been. Hopefully you have too. And of course, feel free to subscribe if you want to see more in the future. I have been streaming a lot of No Man's Sky lately. Some Final Fantasy XV as well. And I try to hit up the uh, PlayStation Plus free games every month. I've been playing Stories, The Path of Destinies from that lately. That's been fun. I like that one. Oof. Here we are. Space station. It's there. There it is. Let's go there first, shall we? Craft more warp cells for higher acquire antimatter recipe. Craft antimatter. Infection facility detected. That'll probably teach me antimatter, won't it? 
wanted. Uh, abandoned facility detected. It's another GEC system. Hello. Nice hats, you guys. Nice hats. It's the GEC hat club. <laughs> nice hats to everyone. <clears throat> yeah, let's see. Nope. Alright, alright. Fair enough. in my face. What is that manufacturing facility? There it is on the moon. It's on the moon? Oh hell yeah. I'd love to go to a moon first. Let's go learn my anti-matter recipe. Facility. I wonder if this is a barren planet. Maybe it'll have spadonium as well. Why am I flying like this? Oh yeah, the the, the bubble around the manufacturing facilities. I guess they still haven't fixed that, eh? Mild sentinels threatening. Oh no, it's a lush moon. It's a lush moon. Sentinels threatening. Sentinels threatening. Shit, I'm just gonna bust in. Go, 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 you idiot. Oh, there we go. Get out of here, you creep. <laughs> Get out of here. Oh, cow. Beam intensifier, Theta. Standing with the Gek increased. Sab Jazz, welcome to the chat. Ah, get out of here. Uh, uh. I found a lush moon and the sentinels want to kill me. Somewhere below my feet I hear the endless churn of automated machinery performing unknown tasks for unknown ma masters. I'll just take the formula. With this knowledge I can create warp cells, the final puzzle piece. I can now travel anywhere I please or should I follow the Atlas or find Nada and Polo? Actually, hold on. What did that say? A screen flickers into life and letters stamp themselves across it. Nada, nada. Escape Atlas. Find us. Nada, nada. And then a formula is displayed. How to make my own antimatter. So that one's like a secret message from Nada and Polo. Oh, Sab Jazz, I've already died in this stream. You missed it. I died almost right off the bat. Pirates in space. Look at this guy. Creepazoid. He's gonna attack me as soon as I walk out. Oh yeah, he wants to. What is it, boy? Piss off, eh? Objective complete. A delayed reaction. From the computer. Just 
Is that everything I can scan? Any of those? Oh, there we go. Yeah, Nathan, welcome to the chat. Yeah, it's a Willy Wonka planet. It's a lush moon. So, of course, the sentinels are extra aggressive. Oh, I didn't even hit that waypoint. I thought I did. They're going to attack me. Things are too glassy. Oh, I can hear one coming. Holy cow. These will be the planes of a Phase Archer, who was first in the chat tonight to say hello. Thanks for joining. Oops. Planes of... Phase. Wait. Archer. Thanks for joining. I do like to name the waypoints after the chatter, so feel free to say, hey, if you're watching... Always good to know who's along for the journey. Make some money off of this. No life on this planet, huh? I missed... Yeah, fauna absent. Interesting. Really walk a planet with no... What? Oh, God, I don't have fuel. Why did I land here? Ooh. Ooh. You guys, I landed with no plutonium on me. Oh god. Oh god. I'm gonna have to go out there. And this guy's never gonna leave. He sees me. Oh god. I'm doomed. I'm doomed. Survival mode just got real. Oh shit. Okay, I can run back to the facility door maybe. Ah! Go oh, you idiot. Go, go, go. Ugh. Okay. Okay. I can hide in here. Get some carbon. Look, there he is. That's the one that I left in there. Oh, he's right there. Look at him. Oh god, I ran off the ramp. Oh god, oh god. He's gonna call for help. You guys, I'm screwed. I'm screwed. Hey. Hold on a second. Don't I have... The bolt caster. Yeah. Called his backup. Great. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Oof. Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't know if I'm ready for this. I got the bolt caster, but it wasn't letting me switch to it. my only hope. 
Sentinel Force deactivated. Okay. Okay. Oh. Good lord. So I might be safe in this cave for a minute. Scrapper destroyed five sentinels. That's me. That's me. I'm a scrapper. Scrapper. Uh. I just need some plutonium in this cave and then I'll be set. I just need plutonium. Come on, cave. Oh, oh, oh. You know what I better do? Before I'm out of range? Take that thamium back. Uh, probably that carbon, too. Yep, gonna take that carbon with me. Look, carbon with in the cave. Oh, bastard. There's some plutonium. Just a little bit. A little bit of it. Oh, my goodness. Lush moon, sentinels everywhere. Oh! Well, I'll be darned. Emerald. Emerald right into the water. I gotta stop jetpacking all the way into the water, too. With plants growing out of it and everything. Huh. Oh, I shouldn't have uh, jumped in this hole. Not at all. Great. Great. Now I gotta use jetpack just to get up. That was dumb. these emerald holes though <laughs> emerald buried in a cave with water interesting welcome new viewers thanks for joining gaming Mike here just uh, hiding from these aggressive sentinels inside a cave hoping to find some plutonium so I can take off from this planet where I landed when I wasn't thinking about the consequences. Hope you're enjoying it. Be sure to hit that like button. Let me know if you like the stream. Say hey in the chat as well. And uh, maybe consider subscribing if you're into this kind of thing. That might be a good idea. I don't know. Shiny death trap. Yeah, it is Sav Jazz. For real. Shiny death trap. Not much plutonium to be found, unfortunately. Oh, all that em or all, yeah, emerald showing up on the scan. Thamium up above. Ooh. Plutonium? Any plutonium over here? No. No, no, no. What are these big balls? They don't scan. Can't bust them up. They don't say they're made of anything. I am confused by them. Technology recharge. Technology recharge. There we go. You know what? I am going to charge that life support too. Damien. Oh, guys, give me about 30 seconds. Just, I'll be right back. Sticking with me. Oh, I just want plutonium, though. That's all I want. That's all I want. Uh, Nathan, yeah, I played about 200 hours, and then I didn't play for a couple weeks until the update came out. I hit, I hit my limit with it. Felt like I had done pretty much everything there was to do, but ever since the new stuff came in, I've been playing pretty regularly. It's been nice. Decorations made to confuse me, Sav Jazz? Yeah, I guess they are. I want them to be something, but they aren't. Oh, I thought that was light from the outside. Is it? Oh, it is. Oh, look at that. 
Look at that. A view of the planet out of the hole. Nice. Nice. Did I check down that way? Is that the way I came from? Yeah. Gotta head this way. What is that? It shows up on scan. It looks like a mineral, but it doesn't identify itself. What is it? <laughs> Scenery. <laughs> No, I'm not doing time lapse right now though. Not really, don't believe me, but I'm looking for plutonium in this cave. There's no time for uh There's no time for time lapses on survival mode. <laughs> Everything's trying to kill you. Nothing. No plutonium. This is the end of the cave, isn't it? Uh-oh. Oh, come on. Jesus. Jetpack so weak. Oh, shit. Sentinel made me waste my jetpack boost. There. I can hear him. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Oh, look at him. He went underneath. Trying to get in my face. Ridiculous. Look at how aggressive they are. Oh, God. <laughs> Super aggressive. Get out of here. Shoo. Get. Did he go? Oh, no, no, no. He's right there following me. He's right there following me. Ugh. Why can't I switch to my bolt caster, though? I have it built on my tool. And I can't switch. Is he still following? Oh, my God. He is. He is. It follows. It follows. I'm gonna have to just turn around and kill him, I reckon. Get out of here. Look at him. Look at him try to nudge in. God. <laughs> what a jerk. What a total jerk. I can't believe these guys. Up in my face. Yeah, Nathan, survival and normal mode have separate, as far as I know, separate uh, universes. What is this? More emerald. Oh. Emerald trap. Look at this place. Wow. This place just wants to screw you over any way it can. Jeez. Survival mode. Is this, uh, this is back to the entrance that I came in. Hey, I see you. Plutonium. Oh. I'm gonna need more than that. Why did I land on this moon? This was not a good idea. Oh. Did I walk far enough? Or something? Undaunted. Survive one soul in extreme conditions. I've been a, a day on this planet. A day on this extreme sentinel planet. <laughs> Oh man. 
I learned how to make antimatter, so if I can just take off, I can go back to the space station. I can buy some suspension fluid. Ugh. An achievement for documenting all planets in the solar system? That would be cool. I'm back at the plains of Phase Archer there. I don't see any sentinels around. But, uh... That doesn't mean a thing. At least this planet is not harsh on life support. Seems to be going down pretty slowly, even those times I had to run and jetpack. Didn't seem too bad. There's some Thamium. Oh shit, I hear one. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, I ran away. There's another cave over here. It's following me. It's following. Leave me alone, mister. No, mister, I don't want to go with you. I need to get home. Stay away from me, mister. No more. Deactivate. Go away. Thank you. Alright, that's not so bad. Why can I not change to my bolt caster? I don't get it. Uh... So, I'll go this way first. In this cave. I guess. I need that plutonium. Yeah, Savjaz cleared out a bunch of systems. He would totally have that achievement. <laughs> all, all the way 10 milestones if they did it that way. There's some plutonium. Found a little bit more. Lush moon. Lush moon. I'm gonna need iron for my pulse jets. Where did it go? Charged my bolt caster? Yeah, it's fully charged. It's on my multi tool. I just can't use it. Press R2 to activate. But it's not activating. I can't switch to it. Unless they change the button. They didn't change the button to switch weapons. I've done it in normal mode. Controls. Secondary fire. Switch weapon mode. Oh, now it's... Uh, okay, I was pushing the wrong button, you guys. <laughs> oh, man, I must be used to some other game. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, well, it'll happen to you. Yeah, triangle. I was pushing right on the D-pad. What is that? Elder Scrolls? How deep are the oceans? Nathan, the oceans seem deeper since the update to me. I've seen some pretty deep oceans, but I don't know how to give you a measurement on that or anything. Just, you know, pretty deep. They're pretty deep. Uh... There we 
we go. Some iron for me. That's what I wanted. Do the oceans have waves on any of the beaches? Not that I have seen, Nathan. Not that I have seen. Why is there battle music? Oh, shit. What? Did I bust through? Oh, damn it. Clever little bastard. Oh, wait. Uh, uh, uh. I tried to switch, but I was firing. <laughs> so I busted my way out into the open, and then they attacked. Clever. Clever, clever. There we go. I just need some more plutonium still, that's all. Had to jetpack 20 seconds straight up from the bottom of the ocean, Sav Jazz? Dang. Oh, that was the ESO controls I was doing? Alright, well, that's my bad. That's my bad. <laughs> you know, I get them mixed up. Too many games. Too many mind. No mind. Man, getting irons easy with grenades. <laughs> hey, some thanium on the inside. That's uh abnormal. That's where I was. That's back to that other stretch of cave. There, let me make it a little more obvious that I've been here. There we go. <laughs> Completely. Captain Monday Baker. I'm on a lush moon with aggressive sentinels. I'm looking for plutonium so that I can charge up my thrusters and get off this ship. I'm in survival mode. Sir, good to see you. Thanks for joining in the chat. <laughs> oh, man. I really have to stop and think when Captain Monday Baker tells me to report. That's all that's over here, is just this little part. Ijnakun Luand, that's the, that's the moon. Ijnakun Luand. Fine, okay. I'll just head back this way. There's a lot more cave over here anyway. Great report, carry on, will do, aye aye. <laughs> Watch out for sentinels. Watch out for sentinels. Let me just uh, widen this entrance up a little bit while we're here, don't you think? <laughs> Why not? A little terraforming while you visit. Ijnakun. It's like Cancun, but in space. With killer robots. And strange flowers. Oh, come on. I just need a, you know, two good big chunks of plutonium. That's all. And then I'll be out of your hair, planet. Hair planet. Planet hair. Gonna open a barber shop on this planet and call it Planet Hair. 
the sentinels will attack me every day and nobody will ever come for a haircut because they get attacked too and I'll go out of business and I'll blame the sentinels <laughs> even though it's my own fault for picking this planet for a barbershop and no sand yeah sure Sam Jazz no sand or ocean it's a lushy GM gameplay doesn't want to friggin' do survival mode and find only lush planets, I bet. I bet you he doesn't. I wouldn't. wonder what that is, aluminum? There is oceans, though. This planet does have oceans. I don't know about sand. What's this? There's more caves over across the water. Is that something? Nope. It's just the planet's own natural formations. Okay, I might want to come back out this way at some point. I don't know. There were more caves across the water there. That's good to know. Probably going to have to go to them if I don't find any plutonium in here. Probably going to have to. That's the end of the cave there. <coughs> Hmm. This is not going so well. Stuck on a lush moon with aggressive sentinels. No plutonium. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Sam Jeffs, this planet is lacking in bikinis. For sure. That ocean... I didn't see anybody hanging out out there. Not a single soul. Okay. I'm going to try to cross this field to my ship. <gasps> Look. How much is that? Oh, shit. You'll never take me alive. I better save it. Saved. Take that, you sentinels. You can't catch me. Oh, hey, buddy. <laughs> he found me for sure. For sure. He's on to me. <laughs> oh, man. It's never going to end on this planet. It's never going to end. Is it? Ugh. They'll never leave me alone. Alright guys, unfortunately I do have to wrap up the stream there. Thanks for joining me for this survival mode with No Man's Sky. Hope you liked it. Be sure to hit that like button on your way out if you did. And subscribe for more in the future. I will be back in about 30 to 40 minutes around 9 o'clock Mountain Standard Time. My regular start time. I'm going to be playing some Final Fantasy 15 tonight. So I hope you'll join me for that if you're around. And I will catch you next time. Bye bye.